one, says Norman. I don't, no, I wouldn't worry. Don't worry about people who speak out the corner of their mouths. That's a very important rule in life. Darren Moore in Nottingley, West Yorkshire, you wear red trousers. Hello, Jeremy. Yeah, it's lovely to talk to you. And Before you? we start, I'd like to say that um, I listen to you radio every day. I'm a trucker, and this is the first time not only can I speak on the subject, but it's like me, especially subject. <laughs> really? What, have you got them on now? Well, I had some burgundy ones on this morning. I've been a bit uh, reserved, but I, I do have red trousers, pink tartan trousers, yellow trousers. And they are, they are, they, you wear them, I'm thinking to make an impression, is that right? Or to, to sort of say that, I, that I'm not interested in what the world thinks of me. Well, that's, that's perfectly true, yeah. And uh, the, the amount of smiles you'd be put on people's faces when you walk down the street, we get enjoyment just by making people smile. Me and my wife walk down and you see the elbows going. And it's funny, you'll get an old lady with like blue rinse on her hair and she'll point and laugh at your red trousers and you've got, you've got blue hair. Yeah, what, what's that blue rinse thing about? Have you worked that one out? Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, I know I wear red trousers because cause I get rosacea on my nose, so it's like compliments my red nose, I suppose. <laughs> Are you trucking today, Darren? It's my day off. So you're, you're sitting at home listening to Radio 2 and we've got you on your specialist subject. How good is that? As far as red trousers go, it's, uh, I'll, be, I'll beat your mastermind any day. All right, well done. Well, I hope you enjoy it. Is it sunny where you are or not? Yeah, it, it, it clouds a bit and then the uh, sun comes out, but it's a bit mafting. Mafting, yeah, yeah, I know the feeling. Thanks, Darren. Okay. Love Cheers. Thanks, thanks so much. Yep. Libby emails from Southend on Sea. In 1986,